Hello, hello, hello! What's happening, everybody? MCOC Droid does back again for another video on Marvel Contest of Champions. Today is Sunday, so you know what time it is. Weekly Crystal Opening Time. This one is actually going to be relatively short and sweet. I don't have anything huge to open up. Um, I am saving up for another cheapy five-star featured from the Black ISO market from the Sigil, so that is resetting tomorrow. Um... I'm not at 11,000 shards just yet, but I'm close-ish, um, as you can see, I'm at 9,000 and change, so I assume probably by the end of this opening, I will be uh, pretty, pretty close. I don't know if I'll hit it, but I'll be very, very close, and, you know, I'll pick some stuff up in the next day or so and make sure that I am good to go. Uh, a couple things to talk about. Gifting event is up and running. It started earlier this week. Still have just under nine days left. Uh, hopefully y'all are having some fun. I've done a couple of gifting videos so far. One of them should be popping up right now. Still have a couple of milestones to pick up both from the solo part of it and the alliance part of it. So, and both of those actually the next reward or the next milestone is a greater gifting crystal. So I should be able to do my next stack of 10, uh, in the next day or so. And I may have more after that. Something might be happening this week ahead. Gonna keep it quiet for now until I know what it actually is, but we'll see, we'll see, we'll see. Um, and then this week ahead, of course, is Christmas. Um, so actually, I, I know that we are going to be getting the few gifting crystals from the special calendar, not today, but tomorrow. So for me, that's Monday evening, so I might do uh, part of the opening then. I might wait for that. We'll see how that goes. But yeah, Christmas is this week ahead. It's on Wednesday, so Merry Early Christmas to anyone who celebrates. Um, I'm going to be with family for pretty much most of Christmas Eve, Christmas Day, and part of the day after. So I am definitely going to be on the lookout for whatever Christmas gift we may or may not get. Um, in the game itself, I should say. Hopefully, it's something as exciting as last year, but we shall see. Uh, but yeah, so I should be able to do some more content the day after Christmas once I get back home. And then, of course, the weekend ahead. So that is a long enough intro. Uh, let's get into this. Uh, couldn't wait for the last crystal. I decided to get this opening going. So six Cavalier Daily Crystals. Still want another week of nothing very exciting. Again, these look like uncollected crystals to me, usually. I know it's not a huge upgrade, but there's enough variety in there that I feel like I should be getting more than just basic frags and class catalyst frags most of these weeks. I, yeah, whatever. It is what it is. Um, I've got 11 of these fully formed premiums, actually, so for the heck of it, I'll spin one out and then pop the rest. Um, I don't have much by way of premium shards because I pretty much skipped arena all this past week. Um, just, you know, busy with work and other real life stuff going on. Again, prepping for the holidays and what have you. And just focusing more on questing and, you know, the, the side quest that's up right now and stuff like that. So I was just kind of like, eh, it's, a, it's a good week to take a break from, from Alliance Wars. Even, or Alliance Wars, I don't even know where that came from. Um, Arena was the A word that I was looking for, not Alliance Wars. But uh, that season is going on right now. There's still another week or so left. But, uh, yeah, I meant Arena, so... Like I said, it was, a, it was a pretty good week to take a break, which is nice. Um, you know, I'll do a little bit more this week ahead for some more units and battle chips. Because, again, I want to feed the gifting event as much as possible. So, yeah, as you can see, I've only got five to do from Shard. So, let's just real quick open these up. Um, I was actually going to say, so this is now the, at least the third week in a row that I haven't gotten any uh, four stars from premiums. But I was like, if it, if it didn't happen this week, I would understand. It's only 16 crystals. I get it. It's fine. Uh, I should have a few max crystals just to get another three star. So I might as well. And since I'm here, let's go ahead and pop open these fully formed three stars as well. Get those four star shards rolling in. Um, I updated, I finally updated my spreadsheet yesterday. I have one that I, I keep running on my laptop, um, for three stars, four stars, five stars, six stars, you know, kind of breaking down who's available, who do I have, who do I not have, who's max sig, stuff like that. And, and needless to say, pretty much every three star that isn't relatively new I have at max sig, which is nice. And the four stars are getting up there, too. I think I'm upwards of, like, 80 or so four stars that are max sig. So that is awesome as well. Uh, let me just do a stack of 10 because that is more than enough to do another three star. 
Uh, so quickly convert all those. So yeah, don't sell your champs. Uh, you know, variant four, of course, proves don't sell your champs. But I, I've been saying that for a long time too. You know, don't sell them because the more you pull them, the more you dupe them, the more max sig crystals you're getting. So the more shards you're getting or, you know, slim chances at like Immortal Iron Fist or Awakening Gems or things like that. So yeah, don't sell your champions. Uh, um, it's absolutely worth keeping them, even if you're never going to use them, even if you're never going to rank them up. Um, I am still about 1,400 four-star shards away, so I am assuming this is absolutely not going to happen um, in terms of max sig crystal. I do have this ultimate. Let's uh, We can spit this out for the heck of it for a couple of seconds just to see if I can get some of that sweet 20% four-star luck. And I do not. It is a rollover from a three-star, or I guess we should say a kabam trollover from a four-star, not a three-star uh but that's okay that's fine uh it is what it is let's see so yeah i was looking at max sig crystals uh for uh four stars and yeah that's that's nowhere near enough so i might as well just save those and let's go ahead and real quick open up the free grandmaster crystal see now if i were to get any luck this would be the crystal to do it in for this week because uh of course any five star would be nice i'm starting to get pretty darn close to another six star pull so if i got a five star dupe that would be pretty sweet but i am assuming it's a three star and i am correct no no hope on that reel there was just no hope as it was slowing down uh, but again, that is to be expected. Still not going to open up any of the other, you know, max hit crystals or anything just yet. Um, let's just do these four four stars, and then that's going to be it. Like I said, just kind of looking for dupes. Uh, max hit dupes would be preferred because, like I said, that would be more five star shards most likely. I'll spin out one for the heck of it. Um, Warlock, I actually don't think I have as a four star. I know I don't have stealthy either, so... You know, if I had to get a new champ, if it was one of these new, new champs, that would be fine. But, uh, yeah, just looking for something like this. Old Captain Marvel, definitely Max Sig, definitely the Max Sig Crystal, so that works for me. Let's just go ahead and smash open these final three. Um, I'm assuming that's Max Sig's for Fixit and Magneto, but not for Sinister. And I am wrong! They are all Max Sig. Okay, good. Um... So yeah, look at that. That is that's pretty darn good. And so assuming that these are all going to be five star shards, which pretty safe bet I gotta say, uh, then I will be good to go. I will have my eleven thousand shards that I need for tomorrow. So let's just go ahead and get into these real quick. Same deal. I'll spin out one for the heck of it. You know, on the off chance that I can actually spin out a five-star Immortal Iron Fist. That would be pretty sweet. You know, it's definitely a trophy champ. But being able to not only pull them, but being able to spin them out would be cool. Uh, but it's five-star shards. Of course, it's five-star shards. That is absolutely fine. So let's go ahead and open up these final three more five-star shards. So there we go. I only So I only needed to get three. And I got all four. So that is fine. I am good to go for tomorrow. Uh, to open up a five-star featured number five from this current batch. Certainly hoping for the luck to improve a little bit. Um, I did a triple opening when they when this first came out earlier this week. Check that out if you haven't already. And then in my second gifting event video where I had opened up a bunch of the regular crystals and then the greater gifting crystals, I finished that off with a fourth five-star featured. So check that out as well if you haven't already um that should be it yeah nothing else special to open uh don't have any units for any uh cavalier crystals but even if i did i i think i would save them instead for the gifting event um nothing else i believe down here to open up just yet so yeah that will wrap it up so thanks very much for watching extra shout out as always for those of you hanging out during the premiere if you're catching this on demand let me know how your week went any spicy juicy pulls especially with the gifting event live right now um or did you get any dreaded kabam trollovers that none of us can ever truly avoid uh yeah let me know in the comments below like i said uh i will be gone for a couple days christmas eve christmas day and part of the day after so be on the lookout for more content before then um i'll probably try and record a couple of things to go live while i'm away and then thursday for sure i will be back for probably a bunch of content 
Uh, so be on the lookout for that. Early Merry Christmas, everybody. Thank you very much for watching. Like, subscribe, all that stuff really helps me out, and I greatly appreciate it. Happy Sunday once again. Take care, and I will see you next time.